I will read out the list of articles. Let us check whether we have brought all the articles according to the list. Okay? Yes. <clears throat> Ajay, I'll read out one by one and you take out things from our bag. Okay? Rava, Tur Dal, Chole, a pack of salt, yes, a soap cake and pack of agarbatti. Yes, there is a soap cake, but there are two packets of agarbatti. Yeah, our neighboring auntie also wants one. Na? That's why I have taken okay. one more extra. But why do they have different names? One is Jasmine and the other is Sandalwood. They have a different fragrance. Sandalwood is expensive so it costs more also. But how did you know the cost? See, it is written here on the box. Mm. Now tell me, what is the cost of this other box? It is written rupees 70. <laughs> okay, now let's see the bill. Okay? Dada, what do you mean by the bill? Just take some goods from the shop and the shopkeeper gives them in a bag and we give money and come back. True. The shopkeeper tells us what exactly we have to pay. For that, the shopkeeper prepares a bill. Look at this bill. Hey Dada, let me see it. Yeah, hold it carefully, but it is very important. Yes. Look, this is a bill. The shopkeeper has made a list of the goods that we have purchased. On the same paper, he has written the list of items we have purchased. He has seen the cost or price of each item and written it to the right side in front of respective item. In the end, he has put a line under the rupees and written total. Then he has added all the rupees and paise. Now, this is the total amount of the bill. Let me see. The price of these agarbatti packets are different. Now, have you understood why we must check price of each item? Yes. We can check price of item and the price written in the bill. This way, we can check the bill. Sometimes, some price is written in the bill of certain item which we have not purchased. And sometimes, we purchase some item but the shopkeeper forgets to add its price in a bill. Such things do happen by mistake. That's why bill is so important. And the name of shop, date is also written on the bill. Dada, when I went to the mall with my sister, the shopkeeper did not write the bill. He pressed certain buttons of machine and then a long tape of paper came out of it. Yeah, right. Nowadays, most of the shops use such billing machines. In some places, computers are used for making bills. Funny, isn't it? Tell me, have you seen such different types of bills? Mm, the milk bill and uh, hotel bill and then uh, the electricity bill and the newspaper bill. When we went to the hotel, the waiter gave us the bill in the plate, right? Yeah. Look, we get different types of bills and we have to pay for the bill. But before paying the bill, what should we do? We must check the total. Yeah. Dada, should I make a bill? I'll tell you list of items and their respective prices. Okay? Yes, Dada. Yes. What we learned? When we shop or when we purchase from the shop, we eat from the hotel we pay the bill. The bill tells us how much to pay. Name of the shop, its address and date is written on the bill. The list of items is written to its left and respective price is written to its right. At the end of the list, total price of items is written. Do this activity. Collect different types of bills. Observe and study how they are made.